Jobs for You segment tackling that skills gap. One group working with companies offering dollars to train new workers as long as they commit to hiring them. Marie Lynch with Skills for Chicago Land's Future is joining us with the details on some new federal funding that just came in. Welcome. Thank Welcome you. Welcome back, actually, I Thank should you. say, because we did a story last night on our 9 o'clock news about some of the training efforts that you have and how you're working with some of these companies. And you're telling me your website lit up, and yeah. in fact, you've got another company that is now committed yeah. to hire employees. Correct. Just today, Creative Healthcare is committed to hire 100 uh, unemployed Chicagoans in the next 12 months. And uh, we're so excited to work with them. Another train to hire program. Yeah. Um, they just kicked off 40 yesterday, and they're uh, committing for 100. And this is so great because you're offering the dollars to these companies so that they can do the training, so that they can bring in new employees. But even though you're helping them out, these guys have some skin in the game, too, right. these companies. That's right. The companies have a commitment to hire. They have a commitment to interview folks. And they also put up a percentage of the training dollars. So we're in it together. Um, we put up a percentage. They put up a percentage. And then we get the folks uh, trained. And they have a job at the end when they successfully complete. OK, so let's walk people through this. If they are watching this and they want to apply for one of these jobs, this new hundred that are just coming in today. Yeah. How, how does the process work? Do you interview them along with yeah. the company? Do you interview them on your on your on their own, or you know, kind of how do you screen through some of these resumes that you're yeah. getting? So most important thing is for folks to go to the website and submit their application online, so we have access to their information. And then what we do is when the orders come in, when the job orders come in for the company, we look at the specific skill sets that the companies are asking for. We look at what the individuals are interested in, and then when we see there's a potential match, those folks then. Are are forwarded on to the business client who's asked to, um, you know, hire these folks. They interview them, and then when they're uh, upon, you know, yeah. successful completion of that, they either start a train to hire program or a number of the positions. They literally can start working the next day. Um, so right now, today, if you look at our website, we have a number of positions we're sourcing for. Literally, that folks could start working next week and next month associated with those. Yeah. And this is a great way to address that skills gap that we keep hearing about. Um, that really is affecting not just the nation, but here in Chicago. One company that I talked to said, look, this is the worst it's been when it yeah. comes to that skills gap since the late 90s. Correct. And we're, I think that's exactly right. And we're looking for employers who want to be creative with us in terms of generating programs where they can get folks trained mm -hmm. on that skills gap. And that's exactly right. I think a lot of employers have realized in order to increase their productivity, mm -hmm. they have to address this. Yeah. And we bring that missing link of the funding and the unemployed and the ability to put together a program. Yeah, and this company said, you know, we didn't want to send jobs to China or Correct. South America or somewhere else. We had to figure out a way in order to have those employees here in Chicago, but that it also wouldn't cost us too much to keep them. Correct. And just yesterday, we were at Accretive Healthcare. They said to their trained to hire program, they said, you know, we've decided we need to train organically and this has become one of our recruitment sources because we'd rather not go abroad and identify folks we'd rather homegrown here and this is a you know a mm -hmm. solid recruiting source and a training source and we know that you're going to know our information when you're done and you're going to be a great employee nine hundred thousand dollars in federal funding you're expecting more we are okay. so the more folks that sign up and the more companies <laughs> the more that sign up get. we're going to go grab as much as we can okay sounds great. good thank you so much thank you with uh, skills for chicago lands future mark Thank you, ladies. The CTA also hiring seven hundred.